surely you flick in the check to make the black knight go passive first and then play knight h4 because now what can happen is this knight can spring out to g5 in a bunch of lines and this f3 square david if you want to highlight it uh can be very very tender and this is totally weird what Rapport is doing and it doesn't surprise me at all that the bar has gone completely insane yeah. for I mean, Magnus. This bishop is just a terrible piece. This bishop is a potential monster. So surely we don't let them both disappear from the board. For example, if you take, the white knight will come back and capture and uh, white should be fine here, maybe. But uh, actually, even in this type of position, uh, you have to worry about the black queen coming in, uh, attacking this pawn, this pawn, and this pawn. Uh, this one is a bit complicated, but Lawrence, you were talking about the potential of the light squares, and he actually uses that square you highlighted in this position. He drops back with his bishop, 